Hi ladies, I wanted to get on video today to talk to you about allergies. I know so many people are uh, suffering right now. The uh, season is terrible for a lot of people this year. And I don't use medications in my house for allergies. We haven't needed them in a, quite a long time. So on a day like today, what I do for my son, especially he's the one that suffers the most is I use a diffuser so if you're not familiar with what a diffuser is uh, if you put some cold water in here and you put essential oils in here and they help uh, your respiratory support through allergy season so there's certain oils that work really well in the diffuser and I pretty much have it going at night and during the day when I see that my son is having a lot of issues so the three oils I recommend for the diffuser are peppermint uh, lemon and lavender Okay, um, I don't know if I could show you the sign there. There you go. Okay, and the last one that I use, which is a combination of eucalyptus and lemon and some other oils, is called Breathe. And I'll put uh, combinations of all these oils in the diffuser, depending on the day, and um, it, it definitely helps him. You keep it by your bed, keep it by your desk at work, wherever it is that you're having the issue, uh, you can have that diffuser nearby, and you'll definitely notice that your allergies will calm down. All right. The next thing that I do, uh, as far as topical application, uh, if you're trying to not use medications every day, you'll want to consider using essential oils because I watch my son, his allergies basically diminish uh, a lot, you know, and so noticeably that he actually asked me for it. I put them on topically on his body, so this is what I do. Uh, two things you can do. You can uh, use them in a roller bottle form, so uh, peppermint oil, uh, lavender oil, and lemon are great, which I don't have the lemon roller bottle in front of me. But what you can do with this is you can buy it in the roller bottle form or make it yourself. And when you feel an allergy attack coming on, you're going to roll it right behind your ears like this. You can swipe it across your sinuses. Just make sure that you avoid the eye area. Um, you can also do the back of your neck. You do this with peppermint and lavender. I also use lemon oil, uh, except that during the summertime, you want to make sure that you don't have any direct sunlight coming to, onto your skin where the citrus oils are. So if anybody has told you citrus oils are fine to use, just they are fine, but be careful about this uh, sensitivity to the sun during this time of the year. So I'll apply them behind his ears as well. Um, the next thing you could do if you're suffering from eye allergies, which I know a lot of people have issue with, you can apply um, two drops of peppermint and two drops of lavender to the bottoms of your toes, where your index and middle uh, toe is, right underneath the pad. And you could do this every 20 to 30 minutes while you're having um, an allergy attack of some sort, and you will notice that your eye allergies will calm down by doing that, and I've seen that happen with my son. So these are my go-to oils, peppermint, lavender, I'm picking them up in the wrong order, lemon, and I love using breathe oil for the diffuser, and if you have any asthma going on, tightness in your chest from the allergies, which I actually noticed, um, I was having issue like breathing running yesterday because of the allergies, I'm allergic to grass. Uh, I applied some breathe oil on my chest and it opens up the airways and I felt great after that. You can also apply it at the base of the shower if you're getting in the shower and you're kind of overcome by allergies that day. Put a, a few drops around the base of the shower and you'll find that you'll have, um, you know, you'll have some, you know, calming of, of your issues within minutes actually. So if you're interested for your children mostly, I just want to recommend to you, you always dilute your essential oils with coconut oil. You don't put them on directly on their skin without diluting them because you don't want their skin skin to be sensitive. Uh, so I love the roller bottles for that. The touch, These are called touch blends and they're just easy to use, easy to apply. But if you're using them out of a bottle and you're going to uh, dilute it and put it on your child, you'll do one drop to one teaspoon of coconut oil. So just know that you should do it that way. And for an adult, you could do three to six drops to um, per teaspoon. I, I think I had that right. Three to six drops per teaspoon. Um, so if you're interested in getting started with the oils, you want some help, you're not sure how to use them, it's always good to definitely have somebody to help you along the way because when I first started, I really didn't know anything and I reached out to somebody that was very knowledgeable and helpful to me. Uh, you can visit my website, which is purefitwomen.fit. Um, and you can also contact me on Facebook and I will definitely help you get started and I'll tell you how you can get um, a 25% wholesale discount on your essential oils. And last thing I want to mention, when you are using essential oils, you must be sure of the company and the quality of the oils you're using because there are a lot of uh, fake products out there. There's no regulation on this industry, unfortunately. So if you're using an oil that you're not sure of the purity and potency of it, I always tell people it's just not going to do what it's intended, intended to do. It's not going to work. 
So if you're having trouble with allergies and you think you can buy, um, you know, peppermint oil or lavender oil in, you know, a stop and shop, it's uh, likely not a real oil and it's just not going to do what you want it to do. So I hope that was helpful for you guys. Uh, feel free to visit my website again, purefitwomen.fit. I have all sorts of articles on there uh, regarding essential oils to help you learn about their amazing benefits. And I hope you're enjoying this beautiful day. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye.